Advancing Open Source Sustainability. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 474. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable and self replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. And this is our April 24th, 2022 edition of our weekly progress update. And today's topic is advancing open source sustainability. And we are open sourcing and free sharing all aspects of a sustainable civilization. So everything that you see happening in the background of this video, we are open sourcing and free sharing. And not just what you see, but all aspects of the living experience within these environments. So what you see is the physical foundations of sustainability. So we're open sourcing food, energy, and housing. Those are the physical foundations of sustainability. But we are also open sourcing the emotional foundations of sustainability. And those we've identified and call highest good approaches to fulfilled living, highest good approaches to education, highest good approaches to economics, and highest good approaches to stewardship. And teaching and open sourcing and free sharing, all of that is the complete model as a teacher demonstration hub designed to teach other people how to create teacher demonstration hubs as well. So when we talk about advancing open source sustainability, we are creating open source sustainability teacher demonstration hubs designed specifically to advance open source sustainability. It's like a 3D printer that can print itself. You know, uh, solution models designed to create additional solution creating models. You know, teacher demonstration hubs designed to create additional teacher demonstration hubs. And the more teacher demonstration hubs we have working together, cooperating and collaborating on the challenges that we're facing as a species, the more effective we can be at creating those solutions and creating these environments so that they meet, they completely meet the needs of the residents so that we can dedicate our time and our energy into more of the innovation process that addresses all the challenges that we need to address and open sourcing all the foundations and expanding what we're offering in the categories of food, energy, housing, fulfilled living, education, economics, and stewardship. Putting all that together and open sourcing, constantly evolving and growing those, creating more and more options for people to participate. And open sourcing and free sharing it so that people don't have to participate in the process of evolving those things. They can just take a component and apply it in their life. Maybe somebody just wants to build themselves a sustainable guest house, or maybe they just want to grow something that they've never grown before. Maybe they want to install sustainable infrastructure. Maybe they live remotely and they want to use the research that we've done on, on uh, energy credits and establishing off-grid energy infrastructure just to establish that for themselves, and they're not interested in world change. That's okay. That's great. That's a step in the right direction. Please. Increase biodiversity by growing something you've never grown. Increase the sustainability of your home by building it with sustainable materials so that it will last, you know, 100 years and doesn't have any toxic materials included in it. That's great. Build yourself sustainable infrastructure. Uh, start a home-based education model built off of our open source education plans. Like all of those things because we're spent, we've spent immense amounts of time, our all-volunteer team, researching and creating this so that it's designed to the best of our ability with a consciousness for the highest good, if it gets implemented in the world, that's a step in the right direction. Like that's a huge step in the right direction. So our goal is to help take us from where we're at right now to what's possible. And so, and we're taking all these different foundations and we're open sourcing and free sharing it and making it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrating them as attractive enough so that the idea and ideas will spread on their own, but ultimately so that the complete, the culmination of it all, the one community model of putting it all together as a radically sustainable environment designed to provide a way of living that is luxurious, that is far superior to the way that people are living right now and open sourcing and free sharing that as advancing open source sustainability. That's what we're all about. That's what we're creating. So we can create a global cooperative and collaborative of one community models 
of people doing, taking our models and evolving them, adapting them, changing them, doing things better, hopefully, and working and sharing that with us and us sharing our adaptations and modifications and our iterations of it so we can create more and more open source tools and resources and more and more of these teacher demonstration hubs where people that are dedicated and passionate about creating open source content and creating open source sustainability solutions have a place where they can go and know that their needs will be met, that they will be taken care of. And if they can be stellar contributors within that environment, they will never have to worry about another thing in their lives. That's this, this environment is designed. So people that want to share that gift of creating a better world for everybody have a place to do that. And that environment is like a vacation environment that people will, ironically, pay to visit. The more fun and more amazing that environment is that we're creating, the more successful it will be. And we are, we'll run it and operate it as an ecotourism destination for that purpose. 30% of one community designed to invite people to come and participate and if they like what they see and if they think of this idea of like, man, I'd like my lifestyle to be living in an amazing environment, having a whole lot of fun and making a big difference in the world. Great. Either join us or take what it is that we're creating and create your own version of this that might have things that you like better about it and invite other people that share your values and share your goals and want to create that as well to participate with you. Let's create more versions of this. And through this kind of model, we could create a world that works for everybody. Technically, we could create a world that includes every single human being on this planet within 30 years. If we were to take one community as a model with only 50 people, and we will grow to 2,000 permanent residents and hosting hundreds of thousands of residents annually. But if we were just to take 50 people, and we were to replicate that our first year and inspire two other communities to begin the next year, also of 50 people, averaging 50 people, and if those two communities were then to inspire four more communities, those two and us, three combined, co inspire four more. And then the seven of us working together were to inspire eight more the year after that, and 16 the year after that, and 32 the year after that, and 64 after that, and continue to double like that. In 30 years, we had included the entire human population. Now, do we need to do that? Of course not. We just need to reach that tipping point, that critical mass of participation, so that there's something available for everybody, and so everybody who wants to participate can, and so we are positively impacting the lives of everybody on this planet. That's one community's goal, is to reach that tipping point. And will every community succeed? Of course not. You know, there will be community refugees, people that tried and it didn't work, or they came to maybe one community and like, ah, oh, it's just not the vibe that we want, too much focus on world change and open sourcing everything. Like, I'd like a more low-key environment. Well, great, there'll be other communities that are dedicated to that. You know, or maybe they like a more radical, even more intense environment. Maybe there's, you know, fully vegan communities or communities that are dedicated just to personal growth or communities that are just dedicated to whatever it is that they're dedicated to. The idea is for us to create the open source plans, the tools, the tutorials, the resources, the do-it-yourself instructions for, for replicating all the foundations necessary to create a completely sustainable, radically sustainable model and advancing open source sustainability through sharing that as our gift to humanity, and first and foremost, our gift to ourselves, and as a gift to humanity, teaching them how they can gift that to themselves as well, their families and friends, your family and friends, if you're not participating with us, so that everybody who wants to live this way knows exactly what's involved and how to create that. How much does it cost? How much labor does it take? What are all the challenges you can expect? How do you overcome those challenges? Like, how do you deal with the county? We're running tutorials for all this stuff. You know, every aspect we can imagine. So this is what we're up to, this is what we're creating, and um, yeah, if you like what we're up to, if you like the idea of highest good creation and creating a world that is for the highest good of all people that works for everybody, like and subscribe. Um, if you'd like to see the specifics of what our all-volunteer team has accomplished in the last week, uh, visit our written blog with the same name as this video, and the link is in the YouTube subscription. Um, if you'd like to see all the open source content that we've created, Visit our website, explore it. It is hundreds of pages of amazing content. Tens of thousands of hours of work has gone into this as we've continued to develop and design. And uh, last but not least, if you'd like to participate, of course, uh, visit our helping page. If you'd like to contribute, if you'd like to donate, if you'd like to volunteer, support what it is that we're doing, visit our helping page, see all the different ways that you can do that. There's lots of ways that you can help us uh, just through like your Amazon purchases and things like that as well uh, without actually any money out of your own pocket. All those little things make a difference. Liking and subscribing makes a difference. Liking our pages, sharing our pages on social media, all of it makes a difference and all that stuff is described on our helping page. So with that said, that's all I have to say today. I will, of course, Keep on keeping on, and you can stick around for another minute or so if you'd like to see bullet points and all the major components of our project. Thanks for following our progress. Till next week, 
We will, of course, keep on keeping on. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is Highest Good Education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property. One community's approach to Highest Good Education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.